When we define a generic class, the compiler introduces changes into our code. When we define a generic class, underneath there is one class only. When we instantiate the generic class each time with another parametric type, there isn't any auto-generated classes. Uh, we remain with the same one and only class we defined. For that reason, it is impossible to define uh, static members uh, that use the unknown type. For example, it is impossible to define a static variable. Its, uh, type, its type is E. Or it is impossible to define a static function that uh, E is the type of one of the parameters or the return type. For the same reason, if we try to refer E in the static block, it also it is also something that cannot compile and it won't work.